Hi, that's Neil from the Equestrian Athlete Plan. Um, today I want to bring you three exercises that you can do um, to help improve your upper body posture. Okay? Um, the upper body, when I'm, when I'm talking about now, I'm talking about lower back, okay, middle of the back and uh, front, of the, front of the chest. The first exercise I want to show you is a recline row okay, using the um, jungle gym here. There's also a Z trainer. What I'll do is I'll pop a link at the end of this video um, to the Z trainer so if any of you want to have a look at them, uh, they're a fantastic bit of kit, really good. Okay, first one, this is really good for opening up the chest, squeezing the shoulder blades together, okay? Working on that open, open posture there, okay? Keeping the shoulder blades retracted, stopping that scapular winging, and also the, the shoulder pain and neck pain that a lot of you will get uh, from tight um, deltoids and chest, okay? So, first thing I'm gonna do is show you how to go here. So you just grab your, grab your ropes, okay? This can be the table as well, all right? And then you'll just drop in, the lower you've got your feet, okay, the harder it is. As you pull up, squeeze the shoulder blades together, Okay, and take this, take yourself back to the start position. Make sure when you do this, when you've got your glutes squeezed together, okay, and you just repeat that movement up and down, right? But keep those glutes on, and that'll make sure that all the muscles of the of the back are working really well for you. Second one I want you to do is a chest stretch right here, okay? So the palm of the hand against against the door frame, take the outside foot forward and stretch into it there. Okay, you should feel the stretch here through the front of the uh, anterior deltoid and the pectoral muscles here. If you want to improve that, just place the fingers into there. Okay, the more pressure you apply, the harder or the more stretch that you'll feel, okay? And then you do exactly the same facing the other way. All right, so that'll help to release off the muscles in the front of the chest, which are getting tight from sitting in, in, in this position here, okay? The next one, or the last one we need to do, okay, is the pelvic tilt. Okay, so place the fingers here on the front of the pelvis, okay, and then the thumbs on the back of the pelvis. And then what I want you to do, what we commonly see is, is an anterior tilt here, so everything's pushing out through the front, okay? So what I want you to do then is to squeeze the glutes together, Push the hips forward, so now your glutes are rock solid, okay? And then just let the pelvis go back, squeeze the glutes together, push the hips forward. Squeeze the glutes together, push the hips forward. Okay, so now with all of those there, if you want to just create your own little mini home workout, okay? 10 repetitions on the uh, recline rows, okay, or the pull-ups. Uh, you're then gonna go to the stretch, just release off the front of the, the chest, okay? Spend between 15 and 30 seconds on each one, okay? And then you can go through the, the pelvic tilt, Okay, on that one there, you want to be replicating that for about 15 to 20 reps, okay, making sure that the glutes engage every time. And you can move around on that, okay, three to five times, no problem. Um, and that will just make sure you're strengthening up the middle of the back, okay, engaging the glutes and switching off these muscles here. All right? That's Matt Luxton from the Equestrian Athlete Plan. Have a great day.